So why are there empty chairs? I'm confused. Drinks. Drinks? Okay, I'll take it. That's fine. So uh, I'm, I'm Mac Holiday. I celebrate holidays every day on YouTube and on Vine. Holiday what TV? That's what it is. So if you follow my show and if you don't, why aren't you? That would be a problem. Please follow me and subscribe. Thank you. So the basic thing is that I celebrate holidays every day. They're quirky, they're silly, they're bizarre, like National Read in a Bathtub Day, or uh, I don't know, National Hostess Twinkies Day. But there are other holidays, people. Holidays that, that go back to religious roots, about observances, about faith. And I want to educate myself on all the holidays. So I am taking a trip. I will not be here in September. Are you going to miss me? Yeah. Yeah. A little bit? Yeah, yeah. Well, guess where I am going to celebrate and to educate myself on holidays that have the birth of religiosity? Israel. Israel, Israel. Israel. yes! I'm going to Israel! That's right! That's right! I'm going to educate myself. I'm really excited about it. So, you know, think good thoughts for me. I'm still going to keep tweeting and vining and all that good stuff. So you won't miss me too much. Just here at the podcast. I don't know why you would come to the podcast if I'm not here. But you should come. You really should come still. Okay, so um, let's get down to business here. Holidays every single day. For example, tomorrow is one of Dylan's favorite holidays. Dylan, what is one of your, actually the only drink you've ever drunk until recently? Your go-to cocktail in a restaurant or bar? Uh, whiskey. Whiskey. Neat, neat. Come on, don't get embarrassed. One single malt. No, you're lying. Oh, it was a whiskey sour. Oh. Yeah, they said you were girly, but you have to own it. Anyway, tomorrow, tomorrow is National Whiskey Sour Day. That's tomorrow. So yes, Dylan, you can finally just enjoy your, what? Sounds like a bad holiday. No, you need to, come on. There's a secret whiskey sour sitting inside of you still. Holiday for girls, probably. Whatever, you're judging, whatever. So on Saturday, one of my favorite holidays, International Bacon Day. Who loves bacon? Yes, yes. I'm guessing in Israel that's probably not celebrated. I don't know, I could be wrong. Anyone have a famous uh, favorite bacon sort of pairing? I enjoy the figs and the bacon wrapped around together, right? Anyone have one? Bacon asparagus. asparagus. Bacon asparagus, that's delightful. Anybody else? Bacon ice cream. Bacon ice cream? Who said that? Bacon. Oh, that's awesome. I love bacon ice cream. I have it every year or so. Bacon so, um, bacon what? Vodka. Bacon, oh yeah, bacon infused vodka. Love it. Anyone else before I go on? Bacon and a Bloody Mary. Bacon and a Bloody Mary. Love it. That's a good one. Will you make one for me soon? Yeah. I'd appreciate that. Bacon Anyone else? Maple bars. Bacon, bacon what? Bacon maple bars. Bacon maple bar? Can you explain and elaborate? I don't understand what that is. It's a, it's a delicious donut served in Voodoo Donuts from Portland, Oregon. A bacon maple bar. A big old maple donut with a big old piece of bacon on it. <laughs> That's Ooh. awesome. It's good. I love the detail. We have to have one sometime together. Okay. Promise? Okay, good. On Saturday, it's Franchise Appreciation Day. Yes, Woo! yes. Do you have any, um, any favorite franchises? Subway. Subway's your favorite. Phenomenal. Anyone else? Well, I have a list here of the uh, top 10 global franchises. Only one is not American. We're gonna do a little contest game here. I have a gift card for one of them in the top 10, and you will win the gift card if you can guess the most. Of, of the franchises. So I want to do this. I want five people at the most, because we can't take all night here, five people at the most to guess five franchises that might be in the top ten. The person who gets the most of the top five, of, of your five right, will win my gift card. Have a winner. Yes. Too much time you win! Congratulations, come on! Gift card to Subway, number one franchise! Subway, Subway! What's up? You got it, you got it. 
So let's let's just see what, what the top ten are here. Uh, number ten is going to be the only one not American. It's from Spain. It's DIA. It's a convenience store franchise. Number nine, Dunkin' Donuts. Number eight, Windham Hotel Group. Number seven, GNC. Six, Pizza Hut. Five, 7-Eleven. Four, Burger King. Three, KFC. Two, McDonald's, one Subway. All right, Starbucks is not considered a franchise. It's technically a business only operated business kind of thing. It's only businesses and business, so it's not considered a franchise. That's all I got right now, but now we've got Dusty. Come on up here. Woo! Give it up for Dusty. All right. all right, this man here, his name is Dusty Trevino, our sponsor tonight for the fourth time for consecutive months. Woo! Yes, yes. I wonder where you're from. Yeah, I wonder, right? Yeah, Doug Vegas. Vegas. Very exciting. I love it. So now, remember the first time we hung out and I was like, Trevino, remember the old days? Oh, yeah, yeah. I those, that yeah. was good. It was yeah. nice. I still can't remember the wines. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's okay. We're not going to go there tonight. Okay, thank you. So uh, you have uh, a lot of big advancements and announcements every month, I feel like. Around the corner, we have September. More announcements. There's a contest going on. Please tell them. Yeah, so we've got All a right. contest going on with One and One Domain, which is one of the largest registrars it out is. there. So, yeah, we've got a contest going on with them right now where we're giving away Fizz and Fuzz.Vegas is just kind of a promotional piece. So if anybody is interested in trying to win uh, registration for Fizz or Fuzz.Vegas, you can actually go to our website for the contest rules and submit. You can go to Nick.Vegas, so N-I-C.Vegas forward slash contest. So what does that mean, Fizz and Fuzz.Vegas? They, they... You know, just kind of some fun names we pulled out of the hat kind of thing to give away. Uh, so they to have to basically come up with an, a premise for a Fizz or Fuzz. Exactly, exactly, exactly. And like you would have a good one? If you had a Fizz.Vegas, what would it be? Or a Fuzz.Vegas? You over there, what's it going to be? Alka-Seltzer. There you All go. Right, for Alka I like it. <laughs> yeah, I do too. All right, in the back, way in the back. A, a Reno 911 spoon. <laughs> okay. Oh, there you go. Yo, I like not? those. I like yes. those ideas. Dollar razors. What is it? Dollar razors. Dollar razors? <laughs> those oh, are some great fizz, ideas. Or for fuzz. Because yeah. for fuzz, that's good. Those are yes. very good ones. Uh, unique sodas. Unique yeah. sodas, I'm loving. A pocket lint collective. <laughs> a pocket lint. Lint collective for the fuzz. For the fuzz. Oh, you're good, Pavel. Yes. Pop rocks. Pop Rocks. Pop Rocks is good too. All right. We've got a dollop of cotton candy on top of champagne. A dollop of cotton candy on top of champagne. I think that's brilliant. Seuss. What? Kittens. Kittens. Because everything is with kittens with you. They're fuzzy. And sometimes they can be fizzy. Oh, that's good. I like that. Look at those shoes. All right. So now, mid-September, we've all been waiting for this. It's a big, big thing happening. Please share. Uh, September 15th, we go to general availability. What? Which just means anybody anywhere can come in and register a domain name that ends in .vegas now. So it's, it's pretty exciting for us. That is very exciting. Yeah. General availability for .vegas is finally happening. <laughs> yes. Seven years in the making. Seven years. Seven years in the making. And guess what? Did you know this? On September 15th happens to be International Dot Day. No, yes, that's Dot .vegas on International Dot Day has a general availability. That's awesome. I mean, if you had called me and consulted, I could have told you, but it was meant to be. It was meant that to be. To me. Yes, Absolutely. yes. So Dot Day is all about um, this book. It's a storytelling book, yes, where the author talks about this, um, this young girl. She's a student and her teacher. She has a caring teacher, and the teacher encourages her to go find and self-discover herself and to travel around the world, making her mark on the planet, hence her dot in the world. Hmm. So I feel like this relates to you guys as far as dotting ourselves around Vegas, oh, earning a lovely digital brand. I love it. You know, I yeah. brought it all together at the holiday. Am I, <laughs> am I brilliant or what? I'm just saying, yeah. pretty freaking good. All right, so now what happens the day after that day? Hmm. Don't yeah. take tips Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. So the, so the day after, we're actually going to do a nice little press conference at the steps of City Hall with the mayor. He's going to come out and do kind of ribbon cutting for us. Wow. Uh, we actually have one of the VPs of GoDaddy coming over as well, which everybody, I think, kind of knows who GoDaddy is, the largest registrar yes. in the world. So we're pretty excited about that to kind of kind of kick off our whole, our, our whole launch on the 15th. So you got GoDaddy going to be there, but you're doing the contest the one-on-one. -on -one. I don't know. We've, got, we've kind of got to be fair for all the registrars. I see. So, but yeah. Because they all want to be with Dot Vegas. Yeah, they do. They're very, there's a lot of interest with the Dot Vegas. That's amazing. So. Who's going to get a Dot Vegas? 
I mean, oh, look at those hands. That's awesome. That's amazing. That's you got the mayor and all that. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, so if anybody wants to come to the press conference, it's 10 o'clock on Tuesday, the 16th of September at City Hall, at the steps of City Are Hall. Are you going to go? Anyone? September 16th? I'm very excited about it. Thank we you so too. much Thank again you, for Mac. being appreciate here. We really, really sincerely yeah. appreciate it. Right, Todd Vegas! Happy holidays! Thank you. See you in October.